Hi, I'm going to show you how to use the execute command in Minecraft. First up, I'll show you how to format the command properly. The command is like a sentence structure, it has keywords like if, then run, unless. In the command there are many different types of these structures, but I'll be focusing on if, at, and run. In many execute commands, the first step is to use it to define where the command will be happening. E.g. Execute at the emerald egg, then run summon lightning bolt. This will summon a lightning bolt at the emerald egg. Without the at part, it would summon the lightning bolt where the command was run. The second step is the if part. This is used to define what needs to happen before the command is run. E.g. Execute at the emerald egg if block below is emerald or then set block below emerald block. This will cause any emerald or the emerald egg stands on to be replaced with an emerald block. And finally as you have probably noticed, the run part is what you say, before you type what command you want to happen. Now, here we have two bat spawners, one bat is on a diamond block, while the other is on an emerald block, if we run this command. E.g. Execute at all bats, if block below is emerald block, then summon pig. The bat on the emerald block, gets a friend, while the diamond bat is still alone. Over here we have some command blocks, when we activate them, they will repeatedly see if their commands conditions are met, then run them. Here is the first one. Second one is a bit different, it is only affecting a mob with a certain name. This is done by adding name equals Bob to the at e type equals Minecraft Endermite. I'll stand back for this one. Thirdly we have this command block which will see if a structure is built, then cause a surprise. Finally we have this command. Oh eggs, let's throw them. 